guys, you're watching University TV. Today we're at the University of South Alabama. I'll be your host, Shayna. Let's take a tour. USA is located in Mobile, Alabama, a historic metropolitan area on the Gulf of Mexico. Mobile offers long summers that give you more than enough time to spend on the white sandy beaches or at nearby shopping. Mobile is a great location. We're located right on the Gulf of Mexico. It's a very sunny place, great beaches, perfect weather. Uh, there's a fantastic history here. Uh, we have Fort Condé, Fort Gaines, Fort Morgan, of course where the Civil War was, was fought. Uh, we have the Buffalo Soldier Cemetery that was located some years ago. So with us living here, you have to understand and appreciate this, this fantastic area that we call Mobile. South Alabama's campus covers 1,215 acres and features a beautiful mix of nature and metro life. Because it's one of the fastest growing universities in Alabama, two more campuses have been added. South was founded in the 1960s and has grown very quickly since then. We've risen to about 14,000 students and we're still growing. The University of South Alabama enrolls over 14,000 students from 49 states and 98 countries. 63% are women and 37% are men. Acceptance into South Alabama is moderately difficult, and in order to be considered, incoming freshmen need a minimum ACT composite of 19, an SAT score of 900, and a high school GPA of at least 2.0. All right, transferring here, my advisors pretty much helped me get in the team, like taking all my classes. I could pretty much come to them with anything that I needed, and they'd help me out. Full-time in-state students can expect to pay around $10,600 per year for tuition, books, and room and board. All you out-of-staters can expect to pay about $14,600 per year. USA offers close to 100 majors and programs. With very strong medical and education programs, USA has provided the community with a third of the area's doctors and 85% of Mobile's public school teachers. In case you haven't heard, USA has the largest nursing program in Alabama and operates one of the only two medical schools in the state. Pretty impressive. People from all over the world come to South to major in meteorology. They have an operational forecast center that provides weather to many surrounding states and a broadcast center that allows students to hone their skills on screen. Today in Mobile, we're having beautiful weather. I think I'm gonna head to the beach. I'll see you guys there. Some of the most popular undergraduate majors are nursing, business, communications, biomedical sciences, education, and biology. I'm here at the Wave Basin, where civil engineering students can research beach nourishment and wave loads on bridge decks. Let's check this out. With such high standards for students, South Alabama employs some of the best teachers. 76% have PhDs and 40% of full-time faculty are tenured. With a student-to-faculty ratio of only 18 to 1 and an average class size of 23, students will have a great opportunity to work closely and effectively with their professors. I've had students who have gone out and started their own businesses. I've had uh, several students, at least five students, who based on strategies that we've learned in class have gone out to businesses and the businesses have actually created positions for them. I have a number of students who've become presidents and vice presidents of firms and I have a former student right now who's on our board of trustees. The South Alabama Jaguars compete at the Division I level with 14 men's and women's sports teams in the Sun Belt Conference. And get excited people, football is coming. Students have their pick of 41 different residence buildings on campus, ranging from apartment style to suite style accommodations. In addition, laundry is free and recreational facilities are within walking distance. I've actually lived in the Epsilon where they have uh, only freshmen, so you can have the full freshman experience. And we would always get together, it'd be all girls in one floor, and we'd have little activities, we'd eat together, we'd have a crawfish boil. The University of South Alabama has a large Greek presence with fraternity and sorority houses right on campus. If the Greek life isn't for you, that's okay too, since USA has over 200 other clubs and organizations to pick from, like intramural sports, a student-run newspaper, and a student-run television station. There are a lot of ways to meet people on campus and we have over 200 student organizations. We have intramural games such as softball, which I'll be playing. Um, then I'm not coordinated, but that's a way that I'm able to meet a lot of people. There are also different organizations for religious groups or um, just interests that it may not necessarily be your major, but I'm interested in anthropology. That has nothing to do with my major, but I go to those meetings. And there are just a lot of different ways that you can get involved and everybody's really excited to have you be a part of their program. USA not only shares All-American initials, but has produced several All-American baseball players, like Luis Gonzalez, who plays for the Florida Marlins, 
Juan Pierre of the LA Dodgers and Jonathan Lieber of the Chicago Cubs. A lot of people don't realize that here in Mobile, this is the original site of Mardi Gras. Huge celebrations, Fat Tuesday, we got it all. So if an all-American school with programs ranging from nursing to education appeal to you, then be sure to take a second glance at the University of South Alabama. Thanks for joining the Jaguars and I in Mobile, Alabama on our tour of the University of South Alabama. I'll catch you guys later.